Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, or good night, depending on what time zone you're in or what time you're watching this video. We're back with Ren, and I am entirely convinced Ren waited until the week that I was away from home to just completely start dropping some crazy stuff. But I'm still very excited because we have Love Music Part 4. Honestly, I haven't been able to check out all the Love Musics yet, but I'm kind of excited because I feel like every time he s drops something new, it's like a whole new genre. Um, especially after listening to Love Music Part 3, that was insane. So I'm curious to see what he does here. And I hope you are too. So without further ado, let's jump right into it. Synchronization is important. <clears throat> oh, I'm so hyped. Love Music Part 4. <laughs> I feel like sometimes some ideas are just a little bit overdone. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> don't even know what to rap about anymore. I feel like I'm just getting older and more cynical. I'm no doubt I'm gonna die true. anyway. Oh, fuck it. One, two, three, four. Oh yeah, put the rap game in the chokehold. Sometimes I might get a bit local. Yeah, 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 yeah. Feeling kind of sick in the photo. And I don't want to see why. Oh yeah, feeling kind of anti-social. Yo, you know he's gonna blow like Chernobyl because he's going nuclear. This man is nuts and he's gonna take the whole planet with him. Oh, I love it. Oh my god. Check please, and I'm back for part four because I killed part three. And it's Hell yeah. Me, it's still the same old G, but I've been low key ADHD because I get distracted as the world collapses. Oh, it's a big two. Oh, yeah. To the COVID vaccine, I was born in an age where the ozone's cracking. I've been off the stage, I've been away from rapping, but. Whoa. Back on my feet. Back. Bro, hang on. I love that he takes a second to be like, listen, guys, I love music, but the reason I haven't been doing music is because the world has a lot of problems that I'm also starting to focus on and try to put into my music but they've been so distracting that I haven't even had time to actually do that they're just draw oh my yo, he and he uses this again as a platform to talk oh red I can up and off the stage I've been away from rapping but I'm back on my feet back on the track I'm attacking the beat Back on my feet, back on the track, like running a track, but oh, okay, hey God, I gotta, this is good. We're gonna try to keep this to a reaction, so I'll save the lyrical analysis for later. But this feels like there's just so much to go into. I'm so hyped. This bass line. tracks we've gotten some of the craziest lines like like <laughs> finger shocker your mom man red is just laying into this right now but also something that i really like is he's talked about jack and the beanstalk and yo tell me that doesn't fit red that red is not jack on with the beanstalk because he's the individual trying to climb to the top where all the giants are who don't want him there who are trying to kick him out because he wants to get to that level too but he wants to do it so he can like you know expand the platform of, of things that he can talk about and, and make sure that the important things are discussed as opposed to the other giants out there who are just there lumbering around like oafs bro he is such a crazy writer <laughs> oh my god I'm just a fun with and it's half on give a one ton suit cause you want some calm oh, oh yeah put the rap game in the choco Sometimes I might get a bit of oh yeah Feeling kinda sick in the cocoa oh, oh, And I don't really feel right Oh yeah, feeling kinda anti-social I think I'm gonna blow Chernobyl, yeah Going off the grid in a postal And I don't really feel right Yo, I love how even there, he's talking about exactly what's happening in his mind, right? Like he, this is what he does with his music. He feels like he's going loco, so he puts it down in music And he's just giving us that straight in the chorus. Yo, that's fire. I'm a reprobate, I'm in the public park while I masturbate And I don't put out till the second date By that I mean put her in my basement Wait, giggity giggity it's polygamy rap Give her the lickety flickety while I'm beating her back she gets Did he say it's polygamy rap? 
because he goes into so many different styles of genres, so it's like he's married to different kinds of styles and game. Yo, this man is fire. Also, are we now accomplices for what we just heard? Because I had no idea. Just saying. <laughs> Way giggity giggity, it's polygamy, right? Give her the lickety flickety while I'm beating a bat. She gets giggity wiggity when I'm going to tap, and I'm the god of fertility when I do it like that. Because oh, yeah. he's the one who produces these crazy flows and music, and he's literally he has so much passion for it. It's like it's he's the parent, bro. What? Oh my god, I'm so sorry I paused it, but hang on a second. Yo, we talk about this all the time. It's like Ren invented the language. You know what I mean? Like he can take things apart and put them in ways that no one else has thought of. It's it's literally like he made up the language that he uses. He he knows every single letter and how to manipulate in the perfect way. Yo, I this this album is so fire. I'm dipping, flipping the architecture Do it better, rap, professor, kill the track, then resurrect the Tip with the top of the hip with the hop and the ribbon and drop when the dip in the spot And I'm dripping in relevant time, a veteran, better than most of the biggest drop I need to later, broken break, communicate with stupid bass, I'm way when I do it like that with the flow. I mutilate a broken break So he's saying that when I'm feeling broken, I just cut that part out and literally put it on the table for me to look But he, he tears it apart Yo, holy smokes, this, this is Fire and I'm loving the color palette and just the stuff happening artistically. And you like a broken break, communicate with stupid best sounds like a record. When I'm like, like now oh. with the flow, let me know that I'm cold, colder than cold. I'm so zero, got that Jesus flow, make your penis grow. Oh. Jesus, bro, are you still so young? Well, maybe I'm a little bit <laughs> yo, yo, did he just <laughs> did he just put in a uh, uh, I don't even know if this is okay to say, but like, you know, that genre of um, explicit videos with the bro and then also talk about like the fact that he's he's got an erection for his music. Yo, this is wild. <laughs> Yo, Stepladder, what are you doing? Jesus, bro, make your penis grow. Oh, Jesus, bro, why you still so young? Maybe I'm a little bit immature. I use jokes just to poke because I'm And then he comments on it. I love that he even says, like, listen, guys, when I'm feeling uncomfortable, I just put that stuff into jokes, and that's what you're hearing sometimes on the track, so sorry if it comes out that way. That's freaking, yo, the self-aware. Oh, my God. Yo, I love that he uses Backstreet Boys because think about what that sounds like, like Backstreet, like someone who's in the back, not the foreground, the back. And that's because that's where he's been for so long and so he's now also in the back of the car, what he's saying, but that's where he's slapping cheeks. So even if he is put in the back, it doesn't matter. He's still going to do what he does because he's ran. <sighs> I love that he just talked about the diversity of his music in such a fun way, but he also alluded to the uh, to the song Suicide, which we're saying the suicide flow, because so he's basically saying I can do anything and still make it sound amazing. Kill it wherever I go. And then he says four by four, like hitting someone with a four by four, but also four by four like tempo. Yo, this is so nuts. And then look at the imagery. <laughs> Killing it wherever I go The rhythm that I'm kicking with precision I'm a vision with my vision I'm a villain with the flow When I kill it, kill it, kill them I'm killing it with ambition Demolition of magicians And it tries to go Oh yeah Put the rap game in the chokehold Sometimes I might get a bit of flow Yeah Feeling kinda sick in the coco And I don't really feel right Oh yeah Feeling kinda anti-social I think I'm gonna blow it, you know Oh yeah Going up again and I'm lost And I don't really feel right Oh yeah Sometimes I might get a bit 
dude, go on. To end it with the acapella. I love that choice. I've said it before, hearing stuff like that, like in Ocean where we get like that round of people kind of singing together, that stuff gets me amped. And he did it here to end this off. This man is insane. Like, Rand, what what are you, man? You're, this is phenomenal. I'm so excited for this album. Guys, we need to, like, everyone make sure, if you have the ability to, that you get the, the album. Sick Boy's coming out. Please make sure that you go and get the album if you can. Support Ren as much as we can. He even put out a post recently mentioning that, like, um, this might be one of the first times, I think it was, that an independent artist takes a number one spot. Let's get him there. Let's get him there, because this is Ren, and he needs to, we need to put him up. He needs to climb this beanstalk. I am so excited. Oh my, I'm, I'm going to go listen to this like, like 50 more times. I've listened to Murderer Live probably already about 100 times. Like, that's not even an exaggeration. <laughs> His music has just been off the charts. It's always been, but it's like he's constantly ascending, and I love it. Oh. Ooh, okay, uh, if you enjoyed, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, or don't. It's totally up to you. Uh, I hope that your week is better than your day, your month is better than your week, and your year is better than your month. And honestly, with the way that Ren keeps dropping music, I think it's going to be. So I am excited. I will see you guys on the next one. I love you all. <laughs>